Take a seat, man. So you're Julius's new boy, huh? You don't look like much. Then again, I don't look like I have an eight-inch cock, so I guess we're both full of surprises. The Vice Kings are named after one guy, Benjamin King. And that shit don't happen unless you're a professional or a badass. And in King's case, he's both. Hold up, I gotta take this. Aisha, what a pleasant fucking surprise. Whoa, 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 slow down. Oh, okay, that's not slower, that's louder. Shit, where's she headed? No, don't worry, I got this. What's up? Some motherfuckers grabbed Aisha's sister right off the street. Shit, man. That's the sixth girl this month. We know who's doing this? Yeah, the Vice Kings. No way, man. Kidnapping ain't King style. Maybe that's like Tanya's going behind King's back. Don't know, don't fucking care. Now, Aisha said they were driving a yellow sedan. Tail those bitches back to wherever they go and get those girls back. Shit, I tell these motherfuckers all the time they bringing their motherfucking woman. Uh, bitch, get out the motherfucking car now. Uh, not fucking playing. Uh, Break yourself, bitch. Break yourself. Gia. Gia. God, you haven't changed at all, have you? Well, not all of us have a couple million dollars to make it's changes. It's always the same shit oh, with you. Oh, here we go again. What did you want me to do? Did you expect me not to take my shot? No, I expected you to remember where you came from. Oh, fuck you, Johnny. Fuck me? Fuck you! You're the one who ran off to be famous. The only time you remember who we are is when you want something. My sister was kidnapped. And I brought her back, didn't I? No, he did. Bullshit! I told him to do it. No offense. Look, if you're gonna help me, help me. But don't you dare try to hold it over me. Fine. Fine. Fine! Relax, man. I'd like you to meet Saints Row's claim to fame. This is Aisha. And tonight, we're gonna kill her. He's being melodramatic. See, I'm signed with Kingdom Come Records. And it's no secret that the label is owned by the Vice King. But the real deal is that once you're in, you can't get out. They rip you off left and right, and they extort you to stay signed. I've talked to Johnny, and he said that you might be willing to help me. Now check it out. Ish has a recording session in a few minutes. That's when we make her disappear and give the Vice Kings a nice fuck you while we're at it. I want you to take Aisha to a session, but on the way, stop at the chop shop to have your ride loaded up with some C4. Park the car at the studio and get the hell out of there. Ish, make sure someone sees you before you jump out. Johnny, I really appreciate it. Whatever. I was gonna blow that place up anyway. Running a little late today? Hey now, you gotta look good to sound good. Want me to let him know you're in? Would you do that for me? She's here, Mr. Williams. I know you're supposed to be dead and all. But you have to look this pissed? Johnny, you said you'd take me out to dinner. And here we are. At Freckle Bitches? Where else would we go? Someplace good? Why couldn't you have taken me to Mykonos? Aisha, it's not like... Hey, what's up? Perfect timing. You boys talk. I'll be right back. Whatever. She don't appreciate fine dining. Now, I've been talking to Aisha's sister. Turns out, Tanya's been fucking people in every sense of the word. Not only is she blowing King's bodyguard, Big Tony, but she's fucking Warren Williams, a numbers guy, whenever Tony ain't looking. Now, between Tony and Warren, the only person she isn't leading around by their cock is King. So I'm thinking, we put the hurt on Tanya, we're fucking up the Vice Kings. And she's got an operation in prong court. That's where we'll start. Roll in there and put the murder on anyone you see, customers included. Who wants to die for a blowjob, right? <laughs> when you go for Tanya, be careful. She probably got some muscle in there. How much is this studio incident going to set us back? Uh, the incident? I'm sorry. I thought some motherfuckers blew up my shit. I didn't realize it ain't no thing. How much? Including the loss of revenue from Aisha's death, I'd say we talking millions. Okay. We got a few contractors that owe us. Convince them to hook us up. That takes care of the building. As for Aisha, throw together some memorial box set. People eat that shit up. That should recoup some of our losses. How's Tanya's side of things? 
grip is short, Mr. King. I'm not happy, Anthony. You said she could handle it. It's not her fault, Mr. King. The Saints have been fucking with That's her. That's what I'm talking about! Are you gonna let these bitches disrespect us? Everybody calm the fuck down. We ain't gonna start a war every time some motherfuckers act hard. We gotta talk about the Saints. Thank you. Hey, baby. They've taken prawn court. How did this happen? How the fuck you think it happened? Look, we need to get together here and just- What we need is for you to shut the fuck up. You feel me? Yeah. What? Yes, Mr. King. I'll have Monroe put some pressure on the Saints. While they're distracted, it should be easy to take back what's ours. Everything else is business as usual. Understood? Now, this meeting is over. Good thing you're here. I was about to leave without you. Now, I don't think I'm feeling the bat today. This is always the hardest part for me, you know? Balancing stopping power with personal enjoyment. Ooh, yeah, I'm feeling this. It ain't gonna be easy clearing all those VKs out of the station, so I told my crew to meet us there. Let's ride. How about you drop the gun, honey? If I were you, I'd listen to the lady. Well, of course you would, you being her bitch. Watch your fucking mouth. Hey, no reason to be hostile. You packing anything else? Just some rubbers. I was hoping I could get some of William's sloppy seconds. Guess I hit a nerve. Do yourself a favor. Stay down and shut the fuck up. You third street motherfuckers think you so smart. Well, check this out. We ain't impressed. Hell, the only reason you got as far as you did was cause King let you. We led you right to where we wanted you and now the police gonna finish your ass for good just the way we planned. Well, that explains how your bitch lost prawn court. Are you gonna let him talk about me like that? Don't worry, baby, I got this. Yeah, Tanya, shut the fuck up. I thought I told you to be quiet. I got shitty hearing. Ah! Now you got a shitty leg. Ah! So do you. Go now! Baby, we better call King. Trust me, he ain't going nowhere. Damn good work, Tony. I'll stop by after I pay a visit to Hughes. I'll see you soon, boss. So what do we do now? We wait. Oh, hold on, dawg. That motherfucker's still out there. The fuck you mean we wait? I mean, you're gonna sit your black ass down and wait because I fucking said so. Don't worry about the one that got away. The 5-0 will take care of him. Oh, so while you lounging, Trey Street keeps jacking us. That's great. That's, that's fucking brilliant. Slow up, little nigga. Come on, King. This is some bullshit. Let me get a crew together. I could roll into the row and drop all them bitches. I'm telling you. No. But Mr. King- I said no. Don't make me say it a third time. Warren, my man, you got the music scene locked down. I need you to bring in the cheddar, not get shot because you think you got something to prove. I can do this! Maybe, but we ain't gonna find out. We got the cops busting up 3rd Street for us, and we got Julius Lieutenant tied up in Anthony's condo. Everything's going our way right now, so just chill. Your time gonna come, Warren. It just ain't happening now. Understood? Yeah, we straight. You think it'll work? It has to. Sit down, son. We got a way to rescue Johnny. The shit Johnny said about Warren and Tanya really got to Tony. Now the only time she's allowed out of his sight is when she's checking on the rebuilding of the recording studio. Every day that bitch gets driven to the construction site in a limo. Then sneaks off to get a free gun with Warren before she goes back home to Tony. While she's busy sucking cock, you deal with the chauffeur and take his place. When she's done wiping her mouth, she'll have you drive her back. Once you're at Tony's, it's all up to you. Please bring Johnny back. Just don't tell him I was worried. Hello, Miss Winters. Is Warren here? 
He's in the back. Keep the car running. Knowing Warren, I should be back shortly. Don't you fuck! Hey, not to be pushy or nothing, but how about you get me out of this fucking chair? About fucking time you got here. Ah. Where's Green? That's much better. Now I heard Green say that he's got some heavy shit in the back. I'll have some of our boys roll on over and bring the hardware back to the crib. Dex, don't worry, I have a plan. Johnny, your idea of a plan is taking the biggest hammer you can find and smashing whatever's in your way. Well, that sounds like a plan to me. Yeah, a shitty one, as your whack-ass robo-leg clearly proves. Oh, fuck you. Next time you try that cowboy shit, you might not walk away at all. No, seriously. Fuck you. Look, I worked out a plan that will hurt the kings and put minimum risk on you. How much murdering do I get to do? None. Your plan blows. Hear me out, all right? King's obviously got something going on with the police. I'll figure that shit out. In the meantime, I want you two to go out and cause some havoc. If we can turn the public's eye to the Kings, then the police won't have a choice but to come down on them. Okay, so we go and do some damage. How do the VKs get blamed? Put these on. I'm yellow enough as it is, Dex. Just put the damn shirt on. Fine. Get dressed. We got a little piece to disturb. Don't worry about it. Look, if it was one of mine, I'll take care of it. But I'm telling you, I don't care what colors they was wearing. It was that crew from Saints Row I was telling you about. No, I'm not making any excuse. I will. Tell your wife I said hello. Goodbye, Alderman. Great. Now we got your crack-ass friends tripping. Like I said, fucking with City Hall is a waste of time. Wrong. Working with them is what gives us power. Yo, fuck that. This is what gives us power. Now get the fuck out of my office. Okay, it looks like the cops been getting in on some of King's protection rackets. Now that's why they've been going so easy on the VKs. We gotta go public with this shit. Now if we- Don't worry, Dex. I have something more subtle in mind. Johnny, you can't be serious. Fuck yeah, I am. Where did you get those? Anthony's condo. He had a big mouth. This isn't gonna end well. Don't listen to the old woman. I'll drive to where the cops are picking up protection money. You make them cease and desist with one of Tony's noisemakers. If we make sure the only cops we hit are the ones working for King, people gonna start asking questions, and the cops are gonna have no choice but to come down on the VKs to save face. Let's do this. I think the Kings are through with the policemen's balls. Now all we got left to do is give Warren a nice final fuck you, and I'd say this has been a hell of a day. Hello? Hey, it's good to hear from... What? Wait, wait, slow down. What are you saying? Look, our arrangement has been beneficial for both parties. Look, why don't we talk about this tonight over dinner? I'm sure we can work this out, okay? All right. See you tonight. Goodbye. See? This is what I'm talking about. Who said you could come in here? We need to talk. Do we now? You've been putting yourself before the crew. Keep talking, little nigga. If you hadn't wasted our time sticking your nose up them white boys' asses, we could've owned the whole damn game by now! I told you before, we ain't getting into that shit. And why the fuck not? That's where the money is! Man, if you got done with that shit back in the day, the Carnales would've been ghosts right now! But you didn't, did you? You were too much of a pussy then! And you're too much of a pussy now! Fuck! You forgot who you talking to! My name is Benjamin motherfucking King! I'm the man who took my crew from being a bunch of baby gangsters in Sunnyvale to being one of the most influential and feared forces in the goddamn city. You know how I did that? I said you know how I did how, that? Mr. King? I did it by knowing when it was time to build, when it was time to watch, 
and when it was time to act. I'm through carrying your punk ass. If I were you, I'd drop them damn flags and get the fuck out of here before I erase your ass. I ain't going nowhere. You ain't hearing me, son. I said... Yo, fuck that. You ain't hearing me. What is this? I built, I watched, and now I'm acting. Where's Gat? Fuck! Listen carefully, player. Benjamin King just called. It seems like one of his boys got a big head and tried to take him out. He's pinned down in the park right now and needs some help. Now what happens to King may not mean shit to you, but him and me, we got history. I owe King from way back in the day, and he ain't gonna eat it if I can help it. You're gonna go out there and save his ass. Understand? I ain't fucking around, player. You bring King back here safe, you feel me? Hey, baby. The fuck you standing around for? Give me a fucking hand! Little nigga, huh? I'm so king who little nigga is. His motherfucking ass is mine. Hey, yo, Tanya! What's going on? You're a bright boy. I'm sure you can figure it out. Bitch, you better not miss, cause if... Thanks for the advice. Looking good, Ben. Been a long time, Jules. Sorry about Anthony. That was business. Let it go. So what's the plan? We kill Tanya, and I get back to business. I don't think so, Benjamin. What? I said no. You alive, we straight. But the Vice Kings? They're through. Then kill me. Quit wasting my goddamn time. Well, you got a choice. You can keep your fucking pride and die right now. Or you can be a man and walk away. <laughs> when did you get the balls, Jules? What's it gonna be? I ain't walking away. Fair enough. Johnny? I ain't walking away until I deal with Tanya. My nigga. Johnny, put the damn gun down. Now you understand, this ain't just about Tanya, right? We finishing the whole crew. Yeah, I know. So let's get to it. Plan? I know where all them fools hang. All we gotta do is roll up there, get their attention, then lead them to the cops. They'll take care of the rest. All right, player. You gonna be Mr. King's wheel man. You ready for this, son? Let's go. Good to have you back, Benjamin. I've been chatting with King, and it looks like Tanya's takeover didn't sit well with everybody. The Vice Kings are fighting amongst themselves. Now's the time to take them out for good. King said he was gonna come along. I hope he hasn't gone soft. And don't ever worry about me, baby boy, because I'm gonna handle mine. All I'm saying is that since you got here, you've been nothing but talk. I've smoked dozens of fools before. I ain't adding to the count unless I have to. Oh, that's just fucking great. I said don't worry about it. I don't want you bitching out when you see your crew. Ain't my crew, son. That's why I'm here, remember? So how about you put your dick away, pick up your gun, and try to keep your knee away from the bullets? Oh, you heard the cocky son of a bitch. Let's roll. Where now? The penthouse. I'm gonna skull fuck that bitch. Hope you don't mind hepatitis. What? Some guys just never get enough of me. I've had more than my fill, bitch. It's over, girl. You're not gonna be able to fuck your way out of this one. That's cute, sweetie. That's just precious. Please! Please don't! Oh, Tanya. Uh, do yourself a favor and die with some dignity. Sucks for your car. We better get out of here. The cops will be here soon. 
You coming, King? All right, let's go. Hey, I know what you told Julius and all, but why don't you stick around and roll with us? I'm sure he wouldn't mind having you around. Don't bet on that. You think you could find a way back to the row on your own? Aisha, you know. The pussy calls. You did good in this, son. Here. I don't think I'll be needing these anymore. <laughs> 